I have a friend who's an artist and he's sometimes taken a view which I don't agree with very well. You hold up a flower and say, look how beautiful it is. And I'll agree, I think. And he says, you see, as I as an artist can see how beautiful this is, but you as a scientist, oh, take this all apart and it becomes dull thing. And I think that he's kind of nervy. First of all, the beauty that he sees is available to other people and to me too, I believe although I may not be quite as refined as aesthetically as he is, that I can appreciate the beauty of the flower. At the same time, I see much more about the flower than he sees. I could imagine the cells the complicated actions inside, which also have a beauty. I mean, it's not just beauty at this dimension of one centimeter, there's also beauty at a smaller dimension. The inner structure, also the processes, the fact that the colors and the flower evolved in order to attract insects to pollinate it is interesting. It means that insects can see the color. It adds a question. Is this aesthetic sense also exist in the lower forms that are, does it, why is it aesthetic? All kinds of interesting questions which the science knowledge only adds to the excitement, the mystery, and the awe of a flower. It only adds. I don't understand how it subtracts.